the format of being robot. I was a game tester for Nintendo back in the 80s and 90s. I tried Super Mario Bros. 3 back for the NES, I get paid at least $100 a week. I even tried Super Mario World 2 for the SNES. But this year, I received a new game console that has never been introduced yet. It was called the Ultra 64. It also came with a game called Super Mario 64. On the cartridge, it said, July 29, 1995 build. It was three days before August. I was so excited to be the first one to see the graphics of the Ultra 64. It was called that before it was called Nintendo 64. I put the cartridge in, and the game started. It went to the title screen. I was the first one to hear Charles Martinet in a real video game. Mario's head popped out and yelled, <laughs> I pressed start and went straight to the game. The design was so cool. I went into Princess Toadstool's castle. Something dark and mysterious happened at this moment. The music was scary and unsettling. I was freaked out by this. I went into one of the paintings. The white screen said, more ale feeding time. I was disturbed, but pressed start. Mario was in a cage inside the ocean. A big eel came up and tried to eat him. I was scared at this moment because the eel looked terrifying. Mario was drowning and the eel disappeared. It had the Bowser laugh, but was even scarier. Mario was kicked out of the painting. The picture changed into a depressed Luigi picture from Luigi's Mansion, even though Luigi's Mansion or depressed Luigi didn't exist in 1995. I was exiting the room. The castle and the music were even scarier. I went to the next room. I went through a different door this time, leading me to a long hallway and a stairway. The stairs went down to a double door at the bottom, and the hall went to a door at the end of the room. I went through the smaller door, and it led me to a garden, an area with a fountain with a statue in the middle. After I approached the fountain, the sky turned red, and the words, L is real 2401, started flashing on my screen with disturbing music, then the screen went black, and popped up again to show Luigi's face down in the water, floating lifelessly. I freaked out after that, and I took the door again, and ran through the hallway down the stairs, and through the double door at the bottom where I proceeded to the next room. I saw a standard blue painting, and went closer to it. Then I saw Wario's head, and he said, You want fun? Wario show you fun! I was running from Wario, and he went closer. The closer he got, the more knocking there was on the speakers. When Wario was about to eat Mario, the screen went black with Mario doing a blood-curdling scream. Mario woke up, and saw Luigi crawling. He said in Tony Risato's voice. Who crawled with us, Mario? Mario ran until he eventually saw Wario again. There were so many crawling spider Luigis everywhere. I was so traumatized by this. Wario yelled. Luigi's and Pat. 69 Spider Luigi's were chasing Mario until they knocked him down. The screen went interruptedly black, and Wario did the scariest laugh ever heard. It showed a cutscene of Wario eating Mario in one bite. Then it showed the game over screen, but with Luigi with his depressed face. Then Luigi looked at me, and said, Wario is gone forever, because of Wario! Then it showed a cutscene of him sobbing for 30 seconds. Wario came up, and ate him in one gulping bite. The Ultra 64 turned off, and so did the TV. I sat in my room in the dark with only one light bulb. Then the power went out. I went to my bed and went to sleep. I shipped the game and console back to Nintendo on July 30th. They sent me a letter on August 2nd. They said, Dear name withheld, we apologize for all this. The Wario head, and Spider Luigi's, and all that. We will make sure this never happens again. From, Nintendo of America. I had nightmares for two months after that. On February 1997, I got a non-scary version of the game, and it was more fun now than it was back in 1995. I quit the job in 2000, and now I am safe with all the games. But there has been a rumor about personalized copies of Super Mario 64, 